hey, look, if you're going to be a vendor blogger, one of the things you have to do is be funny, right? It's just the way it is. There's no getting around it. If you're a vendor blogger, sometimes you win the little competitions you have in the blogosphere by who's the funniest, who comes up with the funniest thing to say. And, of course, when you combine that with the 10th grade reading level, then it gets to be kind of interesting. So you come up with little jokes, whatever. Sometimes when you get into a smack up, hey, what are you doing driving in front of me? Ah, St. Mary's College, I knew there was something I didn't like about you. The car pulls right in front of me. I tell you, you don't have to do these steering wheel cams to be a vendor blogger, but you do have to be funny. And you, get out of my way. You, there. I'm going to drive by this guy that pulled in front of me. There it is. The car that got in front of me. Teenage girls talking. I don't know if you saw that or not, but hey, you know, now I understand. It's just like if I was hanging out at the mall, asking them about cell phone etiquette and rap music, I would probably get my ego trounced in a hurry. That would be that. And I could go on a blog for the rest of the day. So, you know, you get into these smack-ups with other bloggers, the funniest blogger often wins. It's just the way it is. Whoever says the funniest thing wins the argument. Doesn't matter if what you say is right. Doesn't matter if what you say is true about anything, your own product, their product, their age, whatever. It doesn't matter. If you're funnier, you win. 